Hello Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on the energies that are coming towards you. What are you releasing? The unexpected elements. What do you need to embrace? As well as providing you guys with advice. It is of course going to be focused on your love life, but there might be other energies that show up and I'll just mention it. Right, so let's begin your reading. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure to subscribe, turn on the notifications bell. So what does Spirit upon Sagittarius to know during this period of time? transformation a fresh new way of living emerges so this is a very positive and powerful card for you guys it feels as if there's something that is changing in your life there's something that is opening up in terms of opportunities when people transform it means that they shed the old way of doing things and they open up a new way of you know uh, approaching life approaching love approaching career happiness etc so i feel like this is an energy that is going to invigorate you it's going to make you feel energized it's going to make you feel like you can accomplish anything when it comes to life right very powerful very positive card that is showing up as the very first card now if you look at the image it shows a bird that is taking flight so for all of you this is definitely an indication that you're spreading your wings and many of you already know how to fly, I'm sure. But it feels like there's this energy of you soaring to new heights, right? So what is the next energy that Spirit wants Sagittarius to know? So chaos and conflict, unusual card to come out given how positive this first card was. But I'm getting an indication here of um, something more than chaos and conflict because the card that is on the bottom of the deck is called blessed, right? And it's very interesting because this is a card which was on the bottom of the deck. It's number 22 and then we have the number 33. So I feel like amidst the chaos and conflict, you're not seeing the blessings right now because you're going through a transformation, right? So it's very important for you to keep this in mind. Let's have a look at one more card. Sometimes in life, you get so caught up focused on the chaos and the conflict, you don't understand that you're actually <clears throat> going through a transformation. So I feel like this is happening for many of you. <clears throat> so let's see. next card that I have for you is called Fire and Water Dragon. It enables your life to flow with loving force. So prepare for change and to move forward quickly. Expect the unexpected. Have fun. So this is a card that is, you know, a testament to this particular card. There's change and transformation coming into your life. You're going to start to move very quickly. I feel like there's going to be a lot of rapid progress in whatever you're doing. And this can, you know, um, undeniably apply to your love life as well. So, you know, this does have a very big effect on your love life because the transformations you go through have an effect upon your world. Let's find out what are the energies coming towards you. Okay. 
Okay, so Sagittarius, it feels as if there's some sort of conflict from the past that is coming to the forefront during this period of time. We have the card chaos and conflict. I feel like Spirit is telling you that this is going to turn out to be a positive. So whatever adversity or challenges you're facing right now, it's not going to be something that is going to knock you down. It's actually going to lift you up, right? So don't look at it and feel stressed out. Don't look at your life right now and feel as if it's not going to get better. It is going to get better, right? So I feel like that's very important for you to know that Spirit is saying that something that seems to be a negative is actually a very big positive. What are you releasing from your life? Disappointment, sadness, right? I'm also feeling as if you're releasing some sort of attachment to something that you've had. Some of you could be going towards the direction of, um, you know, giving up the good to go for the great. That's what I'm getting from these particular energies. There's some sort of conflict that is coming towards your life and it's a form of a distraction. So I wouldn't be too uh, caught up in it, right? What is coming in towards you? A lot of you could be focused on money when it comes to your career. There might have been some disappointments in the past, but it feels as if these disappointments are going to be turning into successes and victories for many of you. Now we have a card here which is indicating clarity. So some type of clarity is coming towards you and it's regarding some type of an ending that many of you had to go through. It feels as if there's some sort of cycle that you are potentially um, putting to an end. And you're going to gain clarity as a result of it. This could be a very big sort of shift that is happening. What do you need to embrace? I feel like you need to embrace the fact that uh, there's some sort of movement that is going to be happening in your life right now. Let's go to the advice. I'm going to clarify these cards in a moment. I feel like many of you are going to be on some type of a joyride that is going to bring you a lot of splendor, a lot of happiness. Yeah, I'm getting an impression here that it's regarding some type of a communication with the individual that you're dealing with. I feel like something is being kept a secret in this particular period of time and Spirit is trying to alert you to that. Something is being hidden from you because we have a card here of someone not saying much. Then we have a card of communication. We also have an indication of um, a connection. Can Spirit tell us about Sagittarius's love life? Wow, there's been a lot of instability. But there'll be, you know, this energy of which, you know, towards the future, I feel like something is going to be changing. But this is regarding some type of communication that never happened. It feels as if you're going to gain clarity over something that was kept secret from you. That's what I'm getting from this energy. What can Spirit tell us about this energy? I 
feel like once you know this, yeah, there's some sort of victory in this situation. I feel like you know what this is regarding. This could be very much relating to the person that you're dealing with in a way in which they've kept quiet about this, um, you know, something that they've been uh, hiding from you. And I feel like you may discover this. It feels like the energy of which uh, this person kept a lot of the emotions under the surface. It feels like there's going to be a revelation, a secret is going to come out or something is going to happen and it's going to cause a lot of transformation. It's going to be a blessing in disguise. That's what I'm picking up from these energies. It could, it's definitely pointing in the direction of the person that you're dealing with. What they're actually see, you know, keeping as a secret, it's still not being revealed from the cards. And I've pulled you know, literally over 20 cards out so far. I'm getting a very heavy indication some sort of revelation is coming to the forefront. But I feel like it's going to set you free. It's going to bring in this energy of which it's a blessing in disguise and you're not going to actually see it right now. But it does feel like that sort of energy. Again, we're getting the energy of expect the unexpected. Prepare for change. You know, once this change comes, you're going to have to move very quickly. Some type of communication or something that you didn't know will come to the forefront. And, you know, it's... Uh, literally taking us around in circles, but it's telling you that you're going to have some sort of a transformation as a result of it. So I'm going to be exploring the energy of the person that you're dealing with. I'm going to be looking at uh, what the spirit guides are actually trying to say in respect of the situation, because they are literally taking us from one mystery to another. The energies have come out in that sort of way. I hope you guys have enjoyed your reading. Have a wonderful day and take care.